What's up guys, Pure Shots here and today I have a dual com with my friend Shades, he's in my sniping clan and uh, we're going to be talking about our thoughts on COD Ghost, the montage, just things like that, it's kind of a laid back um, thing and we are just going to be talking over some of this gameplay on Securing C. Vertigo and I have my attack insert, my cap 40 and my ballista. Now please know this was before the ballista got patched. This is when the ballista was actually good. So disclaimer right there for you guys. And uh shit, why don't you say hi? Hello. Yeah, so um right. are we gonna start this thing off? Yeah. I already did. So now you can go say anything you wanna say. Um what do you want to talk about? Alright, let's uh talk about Maybe we've taken the lead. sniping in this game and our thoughts on the patch and whatnot. How do you feel about it? Um, I think sniping in the past was a lot better than it is with the patch, obviously. But, we lost you know, that you can live with it. And you get better as you play with them, obviously. So, I really don't mind it. Yeah, I, I'm kind of with Shades. Uh, uh, I'm kind of in the middle. I don't hate it, but I don't love it. It's a little bit, uh, a little bit not as fun to snipe in this game anymore. Like the aim down sight speed's great. It's I think it's kind of balanced. It could be a little bit slower, maybe. It's arguable, but uh, the fire rate is a real killer. Man, when you're shooting people and you're trying to get feeds like how I've been trying to, it's a lot different. Like uh, now you can't even sprint while you're uh, cocking the handle back. So, you know, it's a little irritating, and um, especially in a game like Domination or Hardpoint, it's very fast-paced and usually engaging multiple targets at a time. Like, right here, you see, I can get my follow-up shot really good, and uh, it's really helpful to be able to do that. So, um, uh, Shades, what do you think about sniping and COD Ghost? Uh, sniping and COD Ghost, what I've seen, what they said, the rumors, it's going to be hard. Bullcrap. I don't think it's going to be harder. They don't have any aim assist. First, second, they're probably not used to the sight because the sight looks a lot different than what I see. So, I I don't believe it. I think it's gonna be the same. I don't think it's gonna be as overpowered as Black Ops 2, but I think it's gonna be. I think it's gonna be more like MW2 or Black Ops 1, but not yeah. as difficult. I'm kind of with shades on. Uh, I don't think it's gonna be as fast as MW3. How the um, how you can aim down sights that fast? Because uh, I've seen the gameplay from Phase Cross, and uh, you know it's about the speed of maybe the Ballista or DSR, somewhere in the middle right there. The fire rate is really good for the bolt actions, and uh, I think it might be a little bit more overpowering uh, that game as far as being able to take on a single target, because uh, you're going to be able to see people in your peripheral vision because it's a dual remedy scope. So when you're aiming down sights, you don't get this black thing around it like how you do right now. Instead, you get to see everything else around. And also, um, if you've looked at the sniper gameplay, all of them have been pretty much one-shot kills, and... Um, it doesn't look like you're going to be getting too many hit markers. Now, uh, I'm going to go check to see how much time we have right now. I am recording this in theater. And, uh, Shades, what else? Yeah, uh, we're three minutes in, two shots. Yeah. Shades, how are you feeling about, um, Losing B. just COD Ghost in general? What are you thinking about it? Securing Charlie. I think it's going to be an excellent game. I think that you're going to have to have a lot of skill to play it. Have more time, like, actually put into this game than Black Ops 2 and stuff. just going out there. Using the pistol, obviously, since that's the most overpowered thing, except LMG. I think that it's going to take a lot more skill and a lot more time. Which I'm happy about, because I have no luck. Yeah, I, uh, a lot of um, the pro players like Nate Shot, Merc, uh, Big Timer, JCap, everybody who has a YouTube channel who's a professional player, a lot of them are worried about whether or not Infinity War is going to fall through with their commitment. Uh, on keeping the game competitive because in MW3 they talked to the creators and you know they said that they were going to do all kinds of things and maybe I'm not following through. So it was a big disappointment. It was very hard to watch the their uh, competitions last or last year yeah, in MW3 because they didn't have Codcast. So this is the first game that they ever brought Codcast in. And uh, I'm really hopeful that they bring it back in again for competitive. Um, I think um, the game they're not going to bring back theater though in Cardo. Yeah, theater is gone. 
Hey guys, it sounds bad, but it's really good because you know you're already gonna get a car and it's gonna really reduce lag. And the other thing, well, if you get the next gen console, yeah, also, then it's gonna yeah, have a capture card. In it. What I was about to say after that is, uh, Xbox One's getting dedicated servers for the uh, new games. I don't know if it's just Call of Duty. I'm sure it's for a lot more games other than just Call of Duty. But uh, PS4 sadly is not gonna get one. Sorry, PS4 fans. Uh, sorry, and um, Xbox also signed that contract with Activision again. Yeah, I think it's for like five years or something, so we're going to get the map packs first. I am going to Xbox One, so uh, when that comes out, look on my channel for uh, that stuff. And uh, what are you thinking about the new consoles, Shay? Secure the objectives. Well, the new consoles, I think, they're going to be brilliant. PS4 not looking so hot, even though that everybody says PS4 is going to be better. But also, I was thinking that. Even though that um, people are talking a lot of crap on COD Ghost, it can't be bad because it's freaking made by Infinity Ward. So, and most of the games that Infinity Ward makes are brilliant. So, yeah, if you look at like I, I think Endo 3 might have been a little bit of a flop. You know, it was it was a pretty decent game, but if you look at all the other games, you know, COD 4, Endo 2, those are some of the people's favorite games. Is like that the never played from Call of Duty. And I know those there's a lot of other people who disagree, far. but they make pretty good games. Oh, look at that quick scope right there. You know, your boy pulls it off. Like a beast. And, uh... Yeah. And this is... This is way bad. This, this is a uh, pretty good gameplay. Uh, you know, it's nothing much. I'm just... I just need something to put on right now. And, uh, talk to you guys about... Alright, stick around for the live stream afterwards. Because we will be doing around a May a three, four hour live stream. I'm thinking it's probably going to start around seven, and ten, something like that. Um, so we're not talking about how we met and how the clan fell. Yeah. Alright, we can talk about the clan. I don't really want to talk about how we met. It's a little bit of a weird story. But, um... Well, the I don't mind like talking about it. I, I just kind of want to put it up. Yeah, um... The clan is doing pretty good right now. We have uh, a lot of new recruits we're going to be trying out. And, uh... As a remembrance, we're going to be working on the community Taj. Probably, uh, pop on that. Leader, too. Any thoughts on that shit? Alright. Um, I think that it's gonna be... I think that the community college is gonna go great. I think that the clan's gonna get a lot, uh, a lot more known, and, um, and especially the competitive team. The competitive team is just awesome. Yeah, if you don't know, uh, our competitive team has been doing really well, but, uh, we decided to put it on hold for now. Yes! 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 all in school, I am I right now. And really, Black Ops 2 is dead, and COD Ghost we might start back up. Uh, start practicing in December again. But, um, it, we're mostly going to be concentrating on sniping during the school year because, uh, Shades right here, he is not afraid to play during the school year, play during the weeknights, and then the first day night. Now, the community Tosh, I don't want to give too much away on it, but I'm telling you the clip standards are going to be insane. It's going to be the best montage, or team Tosh. Five man on screen. Call it. Yeah, at it's going to be five man on screen enough. These are all going to be crazy clips. You know, and it's not just going to be food, it's going to be just crazy things. So, I don't want to give too like, much away on it. Like, watching guys. Yeah, things like that. Don't give away too much. I don't give too much. So, uh, that's going to be coming out, uh, probably around next summer. You know, it seems a long way off, and, uh, yeah, that's been great. What, uh, maybe you want to talk about, uh, the one video night thing? What do you think about that? Um, the one video night, I think, I think it's great for his YouTube channel, and he gets the experience of having to get on every day, being an actual leader, having to put out... I mean, decent clips every day, and I think it's a good idea. Yeah, I pick up my stealth chopper here. Sadly, though, when I go into the theater, you can see it's towards the end of the game. What can I say? I'm sniping. I'm just for, I'm playing this for fun, guys. You know, you guys want to talk to me about all oh, gay gameplay. I'm doing it for fun, guys. Don't judge me on my gameplay, alright? But, um, yeah, the video guy has been really great. I honestly... Go ahead. Go ahead. Okay, oh, sorry. Sorry, your mic was lagging a little bit. I didn't know what you said. Um, but if people say if people say that it's right, annoying, watch out, KGR. There's a KGR. 
Alright, back to okay. what you're saying. So, um, honestly, if people say that it's annoying, um, one video a night, I honestly, I don't believe him because at least he's putting out a video every single night, and if he doesn't put out a video, he gives you guys a reminder. He even puts out a... So, I, I don't believe him when they say that it's annoying, but that's their opinion. Everybody has their own opinion. Yeah, um, yeah, thanks for all the support, uh, I've been, I haven't been getting crazy views, like 100 plus views a night. You know, I've been getting a lot of likes on my videos, a lot of people who are my friends have been saying, oh yeah, I watched your thing last night, it was great. This game's coming to an end, so, um, why don't you say your final words, Alright, this is Trace Shades, and I hope you guys have a good day. Alright, Trace Beer Shots, signing out. That was. Alright, so I...